So the Josephine Project. Are you practicing or just? I don't know, I'm just talking at this point. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the Josephine Project. I know what you're thinking. Who is this man? Tell me who he is! Who am I? <laughs> My name is Jeremy Pusey. I am a missionary here in Europe. I've been working with Ted Cox for a number of years now. To have a real father, someone who protected me. For me, a father was someone who caused problems. But then eventually I... You hurt me. Uh, you're here in the middle of Condern, Germany. Um, little town, but big things happen here. Uh, just down the road, a refugee center was built two years ago. Temporary housing for refugees pouring in from Syria, Afghanistan. Follow me, let's go. Let's go downtown and see what we can, what else we can see. Um, yeah, that was uh... well, We have a bunch of people that we know that are headed there right now to the refugee center to work uh, with refugees, telling them stories, listening to their stories, being present, uh, loving on them. It's been like an adventure. One of the things that I am super impressed by uh, taking biblical principles, biblical stories, and wrapping them in the context of today's problems. I think it's going to touch people and it's going to create a bridge um, where we look at the story of Joseph um, and we start to see the truths and principles and how they can be applied to the here and now. What is the truth that God is trying to uh, show us through His Word that eventually is going to make the the film itself richer um, because it's reflecting more accurately what we see in scripture. I did get a chance to go behind the scenes. So let me share with you one insight in this process that Ted took me through. So we looked at Genesis 39. We each took time to really read the, the, the text itself and then we, we went through the process of dialoguing about it. And there was this one insight that really popped out at me, that Joseph still had a relationship with Potiphar even after um, he was falsely accused and put into prison. And there's so much in scripture that we just don't see um, until we take the time to actually look and study it and try to understand it. Why don't you guys join us this week? Why don't you guys uh, read Genesis with us and just soak it in. See if you can catch things in the scriptures that you have not seen before and drop us a line in the comments below. And I want to ask you guys not to forget to pray for the next steps, for discernment and how, you know, how we should proceed. I don't know how it's, what's supposed to happen. I don't know what God's doing, but we look to him. I think that's what's going on. Right. Jeremy Fusey, ladies and gentlemen. Ted Cox. You guys, we're going to ask you to pray. To pray for the Josephine Project. To pray that all that we've done, all that he's done uh, and showed us is going to come to fruition and or what the next steps will be I don't know but I know I'm praying so I'm inviting you to pray as well thank you very much <laughs>